Hi, this is Homeschooling with a Smile, and today I wanted to show you how I made this flower clock for our homeschool classroom. Now, this isn't my original idea. I've seen a lot of different um, uses of the flower clock and different kinds of templates, um, but I decided to go with this one. Um, it made sense for us, and I just thought it was super cute. I purchased this template on TeachersPayTeachers.com website. Um, the template was $2.50. You get the three uh, butterflies and um, all the petals around the clock. Um, then I just used uh, a piece of green construction paper, laminated it, um, and did the same with the, uh, the two um, leaves and put the minute and hour hand there. That wasn't included in the um, template, but it gave you um, a clear description of what you needed to do to accomplish it. So for the clock, I purchased this really lightweight um, clear clock at Ikea for about $4. It might have been even a little bit cheaper than that. It was definitely um, $4 and under. And this is how I constructed this. Now if you go on the website, um, there's a lot of different templates that you can choose from. This one just seemed the easiest to me. It just looked really cute, so that's why I decided to go with it. I used um, yellow construction paper, and um, I cut it to the size of the normal white paper that you would put in the computer. And I put it in, um, sorry, in the printer. So I put it in the printer, and I printed out the template. So the yellow is beautiful, um, it's a really solid color. Now you could use your own printer ink, but I just think it's a waste. It's more economical to use the construction paper if you have it on hand. After I did that, I laminated the sheet and then I um, moved on to the butterflies. I printed them on purple construction paper and I laminated those and then cut them out. For the stem and the leaves, I just used one piece of um, green construction paper. I wrote out the minute and the hour on the leaves and then just saved um, some extra space for um, the stem and then laminated that, cut it out, and um, put it together. I used this um, Scotch brand you see it on um, the scotch brand um, clear mounting squares that holds everything together and this is how it came out hope you enjoyed thanks for watching